If you're new to automation and just starting to work with APIs for the first time, these four methods are the first thing you need to learn. Regardless if you're using make or NAN, every API call falls into one of four categories. Number one is get. This is telling the API to grab some data that exists on another server and return it back using a specific format. It could be one single item or a list of items. Examples might be pulling weather details from a weather API or checking the status of a shipment. Git never changes anything. It just reads what's already there. Number two is post. Post means you want to create something new. Examples would be creating a new user, submitting a form, or generating a new support ticket. You're going to pass data to the API, which will then create a new record on the remote server. Number three is put. Put is the act of replacing or updating an existing record. This is the API saying, update this record with new information. Typically, you will pass some sort of unique ID or string so the remote server knows which record you want to update. Examples might be updating someone's email, changing a booking time, changing a subscription level, or overriding an existing profile. Put is all about editing something that already exists. And number four is delete. This is the API saying, get rid of this. Examples might be canceling a booking, removing an item from a cart, deleting a lead, or removing an unwanted comment. Again, you'll typically be passing some sort of unique ID so the remote server knows which record you want to delete. And now you know the basics of working with APIs.